Before using the condom, check the packaging has the kite mark or CE mark to show that it's been tested and is safe to use and is within an expiry date or use by date. Check the condom package is in good condition with no tears or damage. Once the penis is erect or hard and both partners are ready for sex or close genital contact including oral sex, you need to put on a condom. Putting a condom on a soft penis is really difficult so you need to wait until it's hard. Move the condom to one side of the packet and tear down the zigzag edge. Do not use your teeth. Be careful with long fingernails or jewellery, you could catch the condom and tear it. Take out the condom and rest it in the palm of your hand. Check out the condom is the right way up, with a roll on the outside. It should sit on your hand like a small Mexican hat with the rim on the outside. If you put the condom on the wrong way, it will be difficult to unravel. If you accidentally place it on the wrong way and then turn it around, there may be flumes on the outside, sometimes called pre-cum which can transmit infections and get someone pregnant. So if you've put the condom on the wrong way, throw it away and get a new one. Now pinch the teeth at the top of the condom to expel any air inside the condom. This prevents the condom bursting and allows room for semen or cum. Carefully enroll the condom down the base of the penis, still holding the teeth at the top with your other hand. It shouldn't be stretched to cover your testicles. The condom should feel comfortable, not too tight or too loose and shouldn't move around too much during sex. Try experimenting with different sizes and types to see which one feels best and most secure for you. You can also practice putting them on in private until you get the hang of it and feel comfortable knowing which type you prefer. Coat the outside of the condom with lube. Using lube makes this condom less likely to tear and can make sex more comfortable and enjoyable. Only use a water-based lube, not an oil-based product such as a massage oil, baby oil or Vaseline. Anything with oil can make the condom split. Never use lube on your penis before you put on a condom as it may cause it to slip off during sex. Using two condoms does not make sex safer either. After sex, or when you've come or ejaculated, carefully withdraw the penis while it is still erect, holding the condom at the base so it doesn't come off inside the body. Remove the condom from the penis by carefully rolling it up the shaft of the penis from the base. Don't just pull it on the end. Be careful not to roll it inside out and spill the contents as this could result in passing on an infection or causing pregnancy. Make sure the condom is well away from the genital area. Using the scissor technique, run your fingers down the condom to check for splits on tears. An air bubble should be present in the teeth showing the condom is undamaged. Wrap the condom in tissue paper and throw away in the bin, not down the toilet. A new condom should be used each time you have sex. If the condom is split or torn, you have up to five days to access emergency contraception to prevent pregnancy or to get PEP if you think there is a high chance you've been exposed to HIV. It's also a good idea to get screened for other sexually transmitted infections. See your GP for help or check leesexualhealth.com for details of where you can access free confidential emergency contraception, STI testing and PEP. If you're only 25, you can pick up free condoms and lube from one of the many confidential C-card sites across Leeds. See www.leesexualhealth.com to find your nearest one.